Hey, you're probably uh, wondering, where's the stream chat? Well, this is a video I'm filming offline. So this is content not even my Twitch stream has seen before YouTube. So, and today I will be testing how fast we can run and sprint with every single buff in the game. I'm talking C2 Gene Constellation, talking C6 Amber, any weapon to increase the max movement speed bonus in Diona Shield, literally anything. We are becoming the Flash. All right, let's start with Gene. This is 100% movement speed. Uh, just normally walking and sprinting. Pretty normal. Just a average speed. Let's bump it up. An extra 10% will be added to our movement speed if we add an animal character to our party of four. So unfortunately, I do need to have a total of four characters for this to take effect. As you can see, if I only had two animal characters, uh, apparently the animal thing lights up here, but it does not light up here. So we don't actually get the bonus. We have to have four characters in the party. So I will add Amber and uh, Diona. Where's Diona? Diona. There we go. And as you can see, this time it is lit up. So we do get an increased movement speed of 10%. This is now a movement speed at 110% walking and sprinting <sighs> now let's bump it up even more according to diona one of her talents allow us to have another increased movement speed of 10 percent while under her shield so we're looking at 120 percent movement speed now Snatch. Walking and sprinting. You can definitely tell we're much faster now. You can see her arms and legs move like a lot faster. Let's spice it up again. Let's use Amber's C6 constellation. That is another 10% or actually no, 15% movement speed increase when she uses her ultimate. Now first I need to get some energy recharge. I don't have her ultimate yet. What's up boys? Get some of these fire dolls. Oh, he's smacking my dolls. All right, there we go. We have our ultimate. I'll leave these guys alone for now. I might need to use them later. Ow, what the? He sniped me from that far. What the heck? Hey, get out of here. That's what I thought. Let's pair the Anima Resonance with Diona's shield movement speed increase as well as Amber's C6 ultimate movement speed increase for a total of 135%. Ready? Let's go. And we are walking really fast and oh yeah, we're we're sprinting fast. We are moving. Look at that. Sheesh, man. The arms and legs just get faster as we go. All right. Well, that's not all. We have <laughs> a very special weapon that increases movement speed. I I did this on stream. I rolled for this three-star weapon in hopes to get refinement rank 5, which we did and the effect is we get a 24% attack and movement speed increase after using elemental burst. And I, I'll have to say it, it was very hard to get. There were some hiccups along the way. I may have accidentally got one of these swords and then used it for XP. Uh... <gasps> oh, what am I? Anyways, let's let's do the math. So we have Anima Resonance, 10%. Diona Shield, 10%. Amber C6 Ultimate, 15%. Effect of the Sword at R5, an extra 24%. Let me, hold on, let me do the math here. I'm not that good at math. 159% movement speed increase. Now, I need my ultimate again. So once again, I must say hello to my three best friends. Hi, guys. Go, go, Baron, get it. Let's try it out. Oh, I'm running fast. I'm, I'm walking fast. Oh, I'm sprinting fast. But guess what? That's not all. Constellation 2 Gene allows for another 15% movement speed increase. This will give us 174 movement speed increase. I feel like I'm about to like break like the, the, the sound barrier or something. Genshin science right now. Holy crap. All right. 
in order to activate Jean's 15% movement speed increase, though, we do have to get an energy orb. So what I'm going to do is, well, ask our best friends to see if they can help out with the energy orb. All right, this is it, though. 174% movement speed increase. I just used my ultimate on accident. Whoops. Boom. 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 And boom. All right. I'm walking fast. And I'm sprinting even faster. Oh my god, I'm moving. Oh, that was short-lived because my shield disappeared. But man, even with all the other things worn off, it's just... Oh my god. Unfortunately, at the time of making this video, I missed out on, I think, the Spiral Abyss movement speed buff. So we could have had over 200% movement speed. But, uh, you know, it was still fun trying to find how fast I can actually move with all the possible, I guess, talents and uh, constellations you could have in a party to increase your movement speed. With that aside, though, hey, I hope you enjoyed the vid and uh, how fast you can possibly get in Genshin Impact with uh, all the weapons and talents and stuff. Uh, I'm sure there may be a few things I missed that can maybe even increase our movement speed by more. Uh, I'd be happy to know if you just let me know in the comments and I'd be sure to test them out on my stream actually at twitch.tv slash Twanto. I stream Genshin there Thursday through Sunday and a few variety horror games every now and then. I just finished Little Nightmares 1 and 2. Those were great games. I'm hoping to find a, uh, another game like those uh, in the future. So hopefully I'll see you there. And if you like the vid, be sure to subscribe. And I'll see you next time.